Uh, excuse me. Can I see you for a minute? He's really loaded you down, huh? I'm swamped. Look, I know this is really bad to ask, but I was wondering if you had any time to help me out here. Mm. To be honest, I'm feeling pretty lousy. Yeah, you don't look your normal self. What? Nothing. Nothing. I just, I dragged myself in here today because of what he said, and I'm just worried that if I don't get it all done, he'll find me anyway. Hey, don't worry about it. As soon as I finish going over the specs with Kate, I'll probably give you a couple of hours. Well, you do I'm sick of you making trouble. Shh, What's their problem? I want to Who knows? I don't know why Joel bothers with no her. Way. Do your own dirty You work. owe me! Save us! Joel! Nice to know we're not the only ones in the world with problems. What are you gawking at? So the munchkin decided to kowtow to the big bad tray, did she? Fool me that again and I'll slap you so hard you'll be eating your teeth. What? I mean it. Someone's lost her sense of humour. Be back in ten. What? Oh, go girl! Should I put up with that? Oh, you had plenty of times before. Yeah, yeah. Well, I guess that's just one time too many. Just push you on the wrong day, right? Yeah, right. Maybe you should take a leaf out of his book for you know who. Ah, now there's a pretty picture. Lezo's at work. Roger, please. What? Don't embarrass you. Don't make a fool of yourself. Me make a fool of myself? I'm not the one who's left home to shack up with the dyke. Thought I should let you both know that the fun's just starting. And don't go setting pretty boy on me again. He came on like some little fairy. What's the idea? He gets into my pants like you got into hers, huh? go. <laughs> yeah, sure. I mean it. Or you what? Shove these so hard into your gut you'll have to go searching for them. Now, get out! You stupid... Go on, get out! What is going on? What are you running here, Devlin? This cow's mad and this one's stopping my wife. And by the time I'm finished, you wished you'd kept your filthy hands to yourself. You're amazing. I would have done it. The three of you, in here now. It's not Laura's fault. If it wasn't for her, it would have dragged us out of here. All right. Just the happy couple. Zoe, you seem to have trouble differentiating between the office and a pickup joint. That's not fair. Really? Well, let's think. Margot, Dior, Kay. Why am I getting the image of a vulture sitting at her desk waiting to swoop on any woman who walks through the door? Nothing happened that I didn't want to happen. Ever heard of consenting adults? There must be something about this company that attracts us women. Yeah, like the men. They make women look like a good option. I don't want you bringing your private life into the office. Oh, that's it. When in doubt, blame the dykes. It's her husband that caused the problem. He's the one that barged in here and started screaming threats. Thanks for your support. Well, let's get out of here. I'm not finished yet. You find me over this. I'll have the discrimination board on your back so fast you won't have time to say Martina never had a over. 